This is my home. It's where I live. My home is my shelter. It keeps me safe from rain, wind, heat, and cold. The water I need comes from pipes inside my house. When I need food, I go to the grocery store. I need food, water, and shelter. I live in a place where I can get these things, right here in my house. What about animals? What do they need to live? They need the same things that we do. Food, water, and shelter. Animals live in habitat. A habitat is the type of environment where an organism or group normally lives. It's more than a home. It's more like a neighborhood. A habitat provides animals with everything they need to live. An animal's habitat includes all of the land the animal needs to hunt, gather food, find a mate, and raise a family. Join me as we take a closer look at some of the wonderful habitats that are all over the planet. Let's start with the forest. Forests occupy one-third of Earth's land area and are found on all corners of the globe. While there are few different types of forests, all forests have trees as a dominant plant type. Most forests get a lot of rain and have changing seasons. They are hot in the summer and cold in the winter. Animals and plants have special adaptations to cope with these yearly changes. Do all habitats get a lot of rain so that plants and animals can live there? This is a desert and it's a habitat. A desert is a dry, often sandy region that has little rainfall, extreme temperatures, and sparse vegetation. There are plants and animals that have adapted to survive in this habitat. Plants often have thin, tough leaves or succulent stems, like a cactus, to store water. Some plants remain dormant during dry times only coming to life when one of the brief rainstorms comes along. Animals survive by living underground or resting in burrows during the heat of the day. Some creatures get the moisture they need from their food, so they don't have to drink much water, if any. Others live along the edges of the desert, where there are more plants and shelter. Plants in the desert help the animals by keeping them out of the sun and providing them with shelter. Plants also help the animals by saving rainwater. I know a place that gets lots of rain, the rainforest. Rainforests are the Earth's oldest living ecosystem. The different rainforests of the world support different populations of animals. These incredible places cover only 6% of the Earth's surface, but yet they contain more than half of the world's plant and animal species. Rainforest can be described as a tall, dense jungle. The reason it is called a rainforest is because of the high amount of rainfall it gets per year. The climate of a rainforest is very hot and humid, so the animals and plants that exist there must learn to adapt to this climate. Different animals and plants live in different parts of the rainforest. The rainforest is divided into four different layers. The layers are based on living environments. 
Starting at the top, the layers are Emergence, Canopy, Understory, and Forest Floor. The Emergent layer has giant trees that are much higher than the average canopy height. It houses many birds and insects. The canopy is the upper part of the trees. This leafy environment is full of life in a tropical rainforest and includes insects, birds, reptiles, mammals, and more. The understory is a dark, cool environment under the leaves but over the ground. The forest floor is teeming with life, especially insects. The largest animals of the rainforest generally live here. Colorful and unusual animals dwell in all four layers of the rainforest. All types of creatures are represented. From tiny insects to large mammals. I know another place that has lots of animals. The ocean! Oceans cover almost three-fourths of the Earth's surface and contain over 90% of Earth's water supply. The Earth's oceans are all connected to one another. There are five oceans, the Pacific, Atlantic, Indian, Arctic, and Southern. Oceans are home to a wide variety of plants and animals. There are hundreds of ocean habitats. Plants and animals in the ocean have plenty of water. The animals also need food and shelter. Most animals in the ocean eat the plants that grow there. Some animals eat other animals. Ocean animals find shelter in many places, such as under rocks, in corals, in plants, or in caves. Do fish only live in the ocean? Fish also live in lakes, rivers, and ponds. A pond is a small body of water with land all around it. A pond is also a habitat for many different animals, like frogs, turtles, or ducks. So, what about the cold? Do animals live in cold habitats? The tundra is a cold, treeless area. The tundra is characterized by very low temperatures and very little rain or snow. The Arctic tundras are frozen, windy, desert-like plains in the Arctic. A layer of frozen subsoil called permafrost covers the ground so there is very little drainage of water. Arctic tundras are located in the far north of Greenland, Alaska, Canada, Europe, and Russia. Some animals of the Arctic tundra include Arctic foxes, Arctic hares, caribou, lemmings, polar bears, Arctic shrews, wolves, falcons, snow owls, and Arctic loons. So, a habitat is a place where animals and plants live and grow, where animals can find food, water, and shelter, and where plants can get sunlight and water. So we have to share our habitat with animals and plants.